The National Museum of Fine Arts Maltese, Muzu Tal Arti was an art museum in Valletta, Malta. It housed a collection of works by Maltese and foreign artists mainly representing the major European artistic styles. The museum was inaugurated on 7 May 1974, and it was located at Admiralty House, an 18th-century palace which was formerly the official residence of the Commander-in-Chief of the Mediterranean Fleet. The museum was closed down on 2 October 2016, and there are plans to reopen it as Musa from the Maltese acronym Musu Tal Arti at Auberge d'Italie in 2018. History The National Museum of Fine Arts, at the Admiralty House, was inaugurated by Minister of Education and Culture Agatha Barbara on 7 May 1974. Its collection had previously formed part of the National Museum at Auberge de Provence. Following the split, the museum at the Auberge was left with archaeological artifacts, and it was renamed the National Museum of Archaeology. The museum was managed by Heritage Malta. In 2013, plans began to be made to move the museum from Admiralty House to Auberge d'Italie. In September 2014, it was announced that the move will occur and the new museum would be called Musa from the Maltese acronym Muzu Nazjanali Tal Arti. The museum at Admiralty House closed down on 2 October 2016, and the new museum is set to open in 2018 as one of the projects of Valletta's title of European Capital of Culture. The museum saw 30,000 patrons every day in 2012, and the relocation aimed to increase the number of visitors. <laughs> Location The museum was housed at the Admiralty House, a palace in Valletta, originally built in the 16th century as a residence for the knight Fra Jean de Soubiran dit Arafat. The present building dates back to 1761–63, when it was reconstructed in the Baroque style for the Portuguese knight Fra Raimondo de Souza y Silva. From 1821 to 1961, the building was the official residence of the commander in chief of the Mediterranean Fleet, hence the name Admiralty House. Admiralty House is located at South Street in Valletta. Apart from the museum itself, the area contains several fine historical palaces dating from the times of the Order of St. John that are now used by government ministries and departments. It is also well known for its wine bars and cafes, and views of the city's grid shaped streets. Topic Collections Topic Fine Arts The museum housed the major part of the National Collection of Malta. The collection began in 1923 when the first fine arts curator, Vincenzo Bonello, embarked on establishing a collection within what was then called the National Museum. Bonello acquired numerous works of excellent quality on the local art market, and in London and Italy. Most were purchased at a time when prices in the art market were still within reach of the museum's modest budget. Public-spirited individuals and organizations also left significant bequests. The permanent display included the largest collection of paintings by the southern Italian Baroque artist Mattia Preti (1613–1699), an Italian Knight of the Order of Malta who also contributed to the transformation of the interior of St John's Co Cathedral in Valletta. This, together with a fine and rare collection of antique maps, represented one of the strengths of the collection. The works of other artists on display included Guido Reni (1575–1642), the Caravaggisti Valentin de Boulogne (1591–1632), Giuseppe Ribera (1591–1662), and Matthias Stamm (1600–1652), as well as Carlo Murata (1625–1713) and Bernardo Strozzi (1581–1644). Works by Dutch, French, and British artists were also on permanent display. The collection also included the works of two outstanding Maltese sculptors, Melchiore Gaffa (1636–1667) and Antonio Ciortino (1879–1947), and a noteworthy group of Maltese landscapes. The Grand Harbour of Malta and its environs is the subject of a Joseph Mallard William Turner (1775–1851) watercolor. 
Other works by Edward Lear 1812 to 1888, Louis and local artists representing the same subject were also on display. Topic: <laughs> <laughs> Furniture and silverware. The museum exhibited a collection of Maltese furniture and silverware, as well as Maholica jars mainly of Sicilian production. Many of the jars were in use at the Sacra Infirmaria, the hospital of the Order of St. John. Ecclesiastical silverware was also on display, including a rare 15th-century chalice of Parisian workmanship. <laughs> Temporary exhibitions The museum had a very active calendar of temporary exhibitions mainly by Maltese artists. Museum curated exhibitions have included the following Postage stamp artwork, Emvin Cremona Shaping a Modern Identity in Malta's Philatelic Heritage September to October 2010 showed original stamp artwork and graphic designs produced by Emvin Cremona, most of which were put on display for the first time. Pictures of the Floating World – Yukio E. Prints from the National Collection December 2009 exhibited original Japanese Yukio E. from the National Collection. Victor Passmore in Malta December 2008 to January 2009 exhibited abstract works by the international British artist Victor Passmore from the Museum Collection and the Central Bank of Malta Collection. The Maria Pisani Bequest January to March 2008 exhibited 11 paintings by the Maltese artist Lazzaro Pisani donated by his daughter, Maria Pisani. See also List of museums in Malta Further reading List of paintings on permanent display For the collection of arts read, E. S. P. Noza Rodriguez, Antonio undated. The provenance of the paintings on permanent display at the National Museum of Fine Arts. Melita Historica. p. 97-123. The Cain and Abel in the National Museum, The Case for Giuseppe Vermiglio.